hanging at. We're here at the beach with this lovely one. I want to talk to you guys. I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit, tell you a little bit more about adopting a new lifestyle, what it means. Now, with what I'm trying to create here, this isn't more so of a program, no. This is more of a lifestyle. This is more of me persuading you to do something, to do anything that makes you more active. I wanna take this moment and talk about how I think time is just an illusion when it comes to getting to where you want to be. If you're serious about something, if you're serious about anything in life, how much time it takes isn't a factor to your goal. Because as long as you get there, you're satisfied with how long it took. It's the same thing when it comes to lifting. Four years ago, I started lifting and I got into it through football. I attempted to be a part of the football team. Life situations happened. My mom got pregnant, had my little brother, and I could no longer be a part of the football team. But because I got introduced into the gym, I knew that I wanted to stay active, and I knew that I wanted to see what I could do. So I continued to go to the gym. Throughout those first two years of lifting, I made it a goal to get stronger. Oh, here goes my hat. I made it a goal to get stronger, but in the process, I grew. I grew fatter. And to a point, when that time came, I wanted to see the results that I have accumulated over the years. And it wasn't easy. It wasn't easy trying to diet. It wasn't easy trying to give myself discipline that I didn't have at the time. But I stuck through it. I went down to 180 pounds and life was good for the meantime, you know. But I noticed that I was weaker and things changed. After a solid three years of working out, I finally understood what my body needed and what my body could handle when it came to lifting weights. You know? And I concluded with the idea that I am not the type of person who wants to get shredded and do a bodybuilding show. That's not for me. It's not for me. I probably compete in powerlifting, yes, but bodybuilding show, probably not for me. There are millions of people in the world, all different shapes, sizes, body types, all different goals. When it comes to dieting, when it comes to being a first time dieter, when it comes to, oh man, that's what I'm saying. When it comes to doing anything for the first time, there are gonna be mistakes, there's gonna be mistakes. And the key is to not get frustrated is not to get frustrated when your camera fucking falls. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Don't get frustrated. As a first time dieter, as doing anything for the first time, it's always hard. It's always difficult. Understanding what's, what your body needs, what your body deserves, how your body functions, takes time, takes effort. It's not gonna happen in months. There are people out there who can diet for 16 weeks, you know, but then again, there's people out there who need to diet for consecutive amounts of years to reach their goal. Both scenarios are very, very okay. I say they're very okay because I am not like the next person, the next person's not like me, and so on and so forth. You know? Take your time, take all the time that you need to get to where you want to be. It's about where you want to be in life. I'm saying this all from experience. 
I was too at that point where things weren't going my way and I felt like things sh shouldn't be progressing this slowly, but, and then I'd stop. You know, a lot of people stop when they don't see change immediately. And that's not, that's not how you should be looking at things, you know. I'm letting you guys know what to expect from experience, you know. And as much as it sucks, not everything's going to come to you overnight. Take your time. Be patient. Be consistent. Know that time is really all an illusion. Imagine, imagine this, right? Today's date is, what's today's date? Today's the 26th of June, June. We're already over halfway into the year. Just yesterday you celebrated New Year's, right? Or it just feels like you did. It'll be the same way when it comes to dieting. Every day, every day is only a day. And if you make a mistake, remember that tomorrow's a new day, tomorrow's another day to be better, to be greater than today, to be greater than yesterday, you know? Take your errors as lessons and make sure that you just don't repeat them. Something to hold on to, gotta find it first. But here I am, cause I've been laying under palm trees, waiting for the summer, knowing there's nowhere to go. Cause I am happy on this island, wanna be my fun left island.